Hi everyone, for this video, I will be doing swatches for the new EG Lips Lively Lip Matte Colors. They released four new colors which they say are trendy colors of 2017. So let's see, the packaging is beautiful. It comes in like a silver foil looking packaging and the lipstick, it comes in like a little, um, is it like a glass tube, I guess. It's very similar to the other products that they have released, but this is my first time trying a lip product from this brand so apparently this one is supposed to give you a finish without tightening your skin so it that is supposed to softly settle onto your lips and make it feel comfortable and apparently this is supposed to be long wearing so we'll see and it also is supposed to be moisturizing even though it, ha it is a matte formula but it contains rich hydrating oil that does not leave your skin flaky now the first shade is called Misty Peach Matte which I believe is like a nude beige. I will be doing like a gradation look first and then a fuller lips. With this lip matte color, I noticed that it is nicer having them as a fuller lip instead of a gradation lip color just because I noticed that in the picture, it looks really nice but in real life it's not that nice or like a gradation look just because it is a matte finish and so you have to quickly apply this um, onto your lips before it dries up. Now in regards of the scent, it has like this strawberry banana smoothie scent. It actually, I actually really like it, it smells really nice but the scent will disappear once it goes onto your lips. The next shade is called Fake Pumpkin matte and I really like this color it's a really nice beigey color and it looks really good on those who have fair to medium skin and in regards of the application I really like how it applies really smoothly and easily onto your lips and it is correct that it doesn't feel tight on the lips at all even though it is a matte finish so I believe this is really great for those who have dry lips like me and I did exfoliate my lips before the video however I still have a little bit of dry patches here and there and this lip matte color doesn't emphasize any of those patches but it helps to make my skin my lips look really smooth which I'm really happy about however I wouldn't recommend layering this um, lip matte colors just because I feel like if you apply a little bit more it will feel a little bit sticky onto your lips so I wouldn't do that but if you don't have dry lips maybe you can try it out like as like a gradation look so putting another color on top because that would look really nice as well but I wouldn't do it so here I'm just showing you guys whether it's smudge proof or not and look at that nothing came off which is really awesome and I actually used this out twice and I noticed that it lasted for a very long time and I'll tell you guys really soon. The next color is supposed to be a red chili color so it's called Bold Pinky Matte. However, I noticed that it is much more pinkier on my lips compared to um, how the picture has shown. So I feel like this is like a pinkish red instead of like a red chili shade which I really like because the next shade will be a red color so it's good that they have like a variety of colors in this selection even though the colors are very limited. In regards of the price, it actually costed me USD $7 for each of the lippies and I actually got them from a site that I recently mentioned and I would not buy from so I'll put another link down below for you guys to get it from just because it's a new release so um, it is quite limited around the stores and not many stores sell them but hopefully other stores will sell them eventually and I'll put more links in the description box below for you guys. The next shade is called Red Jazz Matte which is a very nice red color but it also has like a hint of burgundy shade in the lips so it's more like a reddish brownish burgundy color lip so I really like this one because it's a beautiful red color and it doesn't really show any of your dry patches as well and it doesn't go into any of your fine lines which is really awesome actually it's great for all of the lip colors so i'm really impressed with all of these four shades even though it only came in four colors i wish they would have um really small colors just because i like the finish and the formula of the lipstick let me know if you guys have tried any of the lip products from each lips because i would like to know if their products are as great as this one 
So I swatched four of the lip colors onto my arm so let you guys see whether it's smudge proof or not and look at that only the red if it doesn't dry up properly it does smudge so once it settles onto your lips it's actually okay. Now this is the result of me eating and three hours later and look at that it's still looking pretty good and this is how it looks like six hours later so it does last a really long time. So I would rate this 16 out of 20 just because I'm really impressed and happy with the results. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more lip products review and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!